Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on recurring decimals. A special puzzle to warm up the brain cells is on the next slide. The answer will be given at the end. Enjoy. What is the meaning of the following? Good luck with it and see how you go. You will have an opportunity to subscribe to my channel at the end of the video. You are also invited to share this video with your friends. Thank you in anticipation. Repeating or recurring decimals. Numbers such as 3.5, 6.87, 7.888 etc. are referred to as terminating decimals. That is, they have an end point and do not continue on forever. Numbers such as 2.3 recurring, 6.78 where the 7 and the 8 are recurring, 4.519 where the 1 and the 9 are recurring, etc. are referred to as repeating or recurring decimals. The dots above each digit tell you which digits repeat forever. Changing repeating or recurring decimals to rational numbers. It is important to know that repeating or recurring decimals can be changed to rational numbers. The rest of this video will show how to do this by presenting a number of examples. Please be aware that the methods used here are not tricks but sound mathematical reasoning. Change each of the following recurring decimals to rational numbers and the first one is 0.2 recurring. Now 0.2 recurring means 0.22222 and the 2 goes on forever. So let x equals 0.2 recurring, therefore 10x is 2.2 recurring. Now what we do, in the same manner as simultaneous equations, 10x minus x gives you 9x, 2.2 recurring minus 0.2 recurring is 2, that gives us 9x equals 2, so x equals 2 over 9. So, 0.2 recurring is 2 over 9. Example 2, 0.25 recurring, where the 2 and the 5 recur. So those two numbers, for example, that means 0.25252525, etc. So let x equals that number, therefore 100x equals 25.25, where the 2 and the 5 keep recurring. 100x minus x is 99x, 25.25, where the 2, 5 recur, minus 0.25, where the 2 and the 5 recur, gives you 25. So 99x equals 25, therefore x equals 25 over 99. So those two are the same. The next example is 3.4 recurring. In this example, we are only interested in converting the recurring decimal to a rational number. So let x equals 0.4 recurring. So 10x equals 4.4 recurring, 10x minus x is 9x, 4.4 recurring take away 0.4 recurring is 4, so 9x equals 4, so x equals 4 over 9, therefore 3.4 recurring is 3 and 4 ninths. So that is equal to that. The next slide will contain the last two examples. Example 4. We're working on point 1, 2, 3, 4. Now those two dots mean that the 1, the 2 and the 3 and the 4 recur. For example, this is the same as point 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, etc, etc. So let x equals that decimal. Therefore 10,000 x. Now the reason we do that, that moves the decimal point 4 places to the right. So 10,000 x is 1,234.1234, where those four numbers recur. 
So 10,000x minus x is 9,999x. And this number minus that recurring decimal is 1, 2, 3, 4. So x is 1, 2, 3, 4 over 9, 9, 9, 9. So that is equal to that. Now the last example is a little bit more complicated, but it's not too difficult, just a little bit more involved. 2.54 recurring, this means that the 4 keeps repeating. So basically we're just interested in the point 0 0.04. We'll leave the 2.5 out, because they don't recur, we could use them later. We're interested in the point 0 0.04 part. So let x equal point 0 0.04 recurring. Therefore 10x equals point 4444 repeated. Therefore 100x equals 4 point 4444 repeating. 100x minus 10x is 90x. This number minus that number gives us 4. So 90x equals 4. So x equals 4 over 90, which is actually 2 over 45. So I've just simplified it straight away. So it's 2 over 45. Therefore, 2.54 recurring is 2.5, which is that part there. See, I told you we'd use that one later. So that's that part there. And the 0 0.04 recurring is that part there. So when we add those two together, we have 5 over 2 plus 2 over 45 because 2.5 is 5 over 2. Now the 2 and the, five and the 45, so 2 and 45 both divide into 90. 2 into 90 goes 45. 45 times 5 is 225. 45 into 90 goes twice. Twice 2 or 4. Add those up. It's 229 over 90, which is 2 and 49 over 90. So that is the same as that. Here's a quick quiz to help you. And please check through the video at any time. The answer to the puzzle, touch up. Oh, I think you can see that quite easily. Here are the answers to the quick quiz. And the video is at your disposal. If you found this video useful, Please subscribe on the next slide. You will receive a notification when the next video is available. Please share with your friends. Hope to see you next lesson.